Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be doing a life hacks video for you guys. I've never done one on my channel, which is really shocking considering these are my favorite things to watch on YouTube. So I thought, you know what? I'm starting school soon, so I'm going to do a school life hacks video for you guys. So I really hope you guys enjoy it. So yeah, let's get to it, shall we? Okay, so you're nervous about speech, right? All you have to do is blow on your thumb. Your thumb is connected to a nerve which is connected to your heart and it basically slows down your heart rate so it calms you down before a speech which we all need we all need because let's be real speeches suck <laughs> you are more likely to remember something that is written in blue ink rather than black ink So if you're a broke college student like me, then you probably don't have that much money for food. What you want to do is go on a site called My Fridge Food, and it is a huge lifesaver for me. I am not kidding. It's not sponsored, by the way, at all. But basically, it's a site, and it gives you a bunch of food that you can check off, basically of what you already have in the fridge. Well, once you check it off, you just press enter, and it gives you a whole bunch of recipes you can make that you pretty much already have the ingredients to and it is a huge lifesaver you don't have to spend anything like i said before it's a huge lifesaver what can i say and it is my favorite site right now because i don't have any money for food the only thing i can afford right now is taco bell so okay so you've probably heard this one already if you're studying what I would recommend is you listening to classical music or instrumentals, basically because if you listen to music with lyrics and words and stuff, basically you won't remember the information as well as you would with classical. I used this one all throughout my last year in college and it was so helpful for me. I used it in high school and it was basically really helpful for me. I'm probably biased because I love classical music already, but if you don't like classical music, that is totally fine. Put on the Spirited Away soundtrack, put on the Lion King soundtrack, change that, don't play the Lion King. Like, you can play Lion King, I don't care, but play the instrumental parts of the Lion King, not playing Circle of Life or um, I Just Can't Wait to Be King, but play the instrumental parts of that soundtrack. You know what I mean? If you're writing a paper for class, copy and paste it to Google Translate and have it read it back to you. That way you can pick up on any mistakes you might have made writing the paper. I was mind blown when I heard that. I was. I was like, why didn't I think of that when I was going to school? That would have been so helpful. Oh my gosh, mind blown. Okay, so this one is also mind-blowing. Why didn't I think of this when I was going to school? I don't know. Color code your notebooks. Basically, what you want to do is just get a pen or a marker and color a little corner of your notebook that's like at the top. And when you're reaching out in your backpack to get your notebook for class, you'll know which notebook it is and you don't have to be rummaging the class for the first five minutes trying to find your notebook. You know what I mean? So this next hack is going to help you out as well. Basically, all you have to do is leave the first few pages of your notebook blank. And here's why. Basically, you can use those first few pages of your notebook for a table of contents. That way, when you're flipping through the pages, you'll know which page it's on because you looked at the table of contents. And it'll also help you out a ton, especially when studying at home. You can just be like, oh, I know what page this is on, and bam. Okay, so if you're feeling thirsty while studying and you're like me and can only drink cold water, then this life hack is for you. Basically, all you want to do is get a damp paper towel, wrap it around your water bottle, put it in the freezer for about 15 minutes, and when you open back the freezer, it'll be cold and ready for you to drink. Why am I telling you this? How is this going to help you in school? Because if you stay hydrated, it'll boost your energy levels as well as help you concentrate more. So you can study again. So that 
pack I'm definitely going to use because I'm always drinking water because I don't like sodas or Sprites or anything. The only thing I like is milk, juice, and water. Okay, so if you're feeling unmotivated to do your homework, then do the snack trick. The snack trick is basically you place candy, cookies, almonds, carrots, whatever on top of each paragraph and when you read it, you can reward yourself with a little snack. That's for people who are motivated with food, aka me. So I'm definitely going to use that hack. And last but not least, always take advantage of student discounts. I swear this would have been so helpful when I was going back to college, like last year. I didn't know about the student discounts. Heck, I was that idiot that never picked up my student ID, so don't do that. Basically, there are a ton of places where you can get student discounts at, and I'm just going to name a few real quick. So Amazon Prime, you basically get six months free trial as well as 50% off once your trial ends. So take that advantage, please take that. Domino's, you get 30% off. Apple, you can get $300 off a Mac as well as some Beats headphones for free. Topshop, you can get 10% off offline and in store. Urban Outfitters, you basically get 10% off. PV Team, you get 15% off, so if you want to redecorate your room, totally can. Adobe, you get 60% off, so if you're an aspiring YouTuber or um, just want to create something, you get 60% off. And Barnes & Noble, you get discounts on textbook and things. All you have to do is basically go to Barnes & Noble and ask about what discounts they have for students. So, yeah, that was basically this little life hacks video. I really hope you guys enjoy it. If you did, please be sure to give it a huge thumbs up as well as subscribe to this channel for more videos every single Friday. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!